playing Steve tonight versus Mr. Don Fan. Don, a Mario player, a streamer. Check him out Steve! on Twitch. But we've got Steve versus Mario. In Cinemore Mario, he's not trying out. He gets cold feet on stream at the last second. And we're into game one here. Here, very quick, looks like I have another commentator coming on. It's your boy DJ Nuts coming back as we get into game one back on PS2. Sack, giant DJ Nuts is, well, back. I'm mm. I've returned. And very quick, 39 from Cha Don on oh, Java. But the cat already. versus the short order mm -hmm. pizza cook. And revenge right back into, into a Lolan whip, into a second of Lolan whip. He's hit him twice and he's at 96. Oh, so I'm coming in and stack deck right and now. And a third it's Mario. time? Hey, oh, he's three! He's hit three Lolan whips and that was a whole stock! Oh and one revenge. God. That's crazy. Mario's the one who's supposed to hit you when you die. Not, not in Cinnaroar, but here we go. And already up a full stock. Another and one! And this luchador is not the loser today. The amount of times I'm saying another one, I sound I just sound like DJ Khaled, but you know, coming on coming on here, Er, er Chavo looking to just keep him in disadvantage, but finding himself there. Both players are playing very Chavo strongly. Chavo already with that fifty one on Mario. Mm -hmm. And he's now seventy percent already, eighty two with that back air. God. Already Mario in disadvantage and this is a really he just got a full of that esteem and the Oh the another one. hook! Another one. And 119. Call in my Cinemore. heart in Cineroar, because this matchup's broken. But Don says not so fast. You might be a fire type, but I can cook with fire too. Finds that F smash there. But he should get more on the command grabs again and again and again. It's absolutely insane, DJ. Like a absolutely DVR, it's on insane. repeat. Oh my goodness. And there we see another move coming out. That time we see the Darkest Lariat. One of the most Incineroar's very active hitboxes coming out. Oh, and Wow, another revenge here. This could just very easily be a stock on Alaria. Very bad. He went for it. Mario combo, not gonna get it. Knocks out the revenge though. Finds the F smash, not quite gonna kill. Chavo can he recover? All the oh, way down. Yes, and he, he can. can. What? And he, what? He, he went. Can Mario off that? He's got the armor. And that armor just, look, you can see there his up B, the very tip of his up B. Stop. He just slid off. Mm -hmm. That was like a Star Wars bridge moment. Just yeah, kicked well, him no, off he was, into he the was, abyss. He was going for up B there. Don was going for up B. And the very tip of Incineroar's up B kind of hit it him out of it. It dinked him a little. Mm -hmm. And it dinked him just on the off that it pushed him from snapping the ledge to going under stage. Like a pinball, he went corner pocket. Yep. And even and even without, Don didn't quite react fast enough. And and that was just game one. And what a fast game from Chavo. Oh, this would be an un upset. As good as Chavo is, is Don currently ranked in the state. So... Up game one, going to battlefield here. Surprise! A little surprised God. that Chavo did ban the stage. Got the builder Mario. Mario skin trying to take him apart Absolutely. piece by piece, and it's looking like it. Looking like this builder's having luck on his contract. Up air, up air, nair, finding a quick 76 to three percent here. A couple air, of clean air. combos and a third and one and two. Double double fair there. What a quick stock from Don saying. You didn't ban my best stage. Two for one pizza and a drink with those. Oh my Two god! Two for one pizza and a drink. And there's the drink right there's there. The there's the drink. There's the soda. Absolutely down throw. Fair. Just finding a quick thirty. Chavo just playing Aang by his roots, not finding all these Alolan whips this game. And but hasn't it revenge. Goes for it there. Doesn't quite get it, but he's just looking for a kill there. And the lariat putting him back to seventy. E. This game really interesting because again, still a big advantage for Mario again, right now. Battlefield, one of Mario, one of if not Mario's single best stage. And why didn't Chavo ban this? It's a little weird to me, but find the back air. Does he think he can right win back, on his own? Maybe. Right back into this, only 71%. Sounds like a lot, but this is Incineroar. He is heavy and he's capable of putting on a lot of damage. Right? We see one move. Both 18 parties right just there. scrapping. What Mario can do in three hits, and Incineroar can do in Up one. Air. Ooh, but he goes to the ledge here. Fights and back into one. the throw. Mm -hmm. And 40% here, 40% looking for that down tilt ledge trap, doesn't find it. It Now who can get find their way down another Again, Alolan Mario's whip? This is crazy. For it. This is crazy. This is absolutely buck wild going on here. here. Man versus cat, this is showing why a dogs and not cats are man's best friend right now. Another and Alolan another whip! Chavo, Chavo's bringing this all the way back. He goes to the, and the belly flop and he gets it! Like Dwayne the Rock. He just came all the way back from that first stock and he's in the lead now! Oh my god. This is crazy! I think, I think, I mean, if Don wins this game, he's got, he's got a mental steal. I mean, it's looking a little even right now. If Don gets the execute right now, it be abso bad. Absolutely, but Chavo managing in the corner, Don in the corner, miss, whiffing that dash grab.
Chavo just using that hitbox to get back. Can he? Can Chavo get out of the corner? Even if he doesn't, 52 percent is a good amount of extra credit. Good parry on that lariat. That God. up smash didn't hit. Beautiful spacing at the ledge. Can Mario find this edge guard? He doesn't with the cape there. And, and it's Mario's a 70. This is looking not great. I think this is. And oh, he, is he, he missed gonna... it? Oh. And Don getting a second lead. And off. he feel he lines up life. the kill. Absolutely. That was a beautiful punch. A hundred percent. But it's a hundred on Mario. And Mario's not super heavy. He's this is about a stat game. Wave. The cards and are against him. Up. Air dodge. He's burned all his resources. Is in, still in disadvantage. Manages to find his way back to the platform. Oh back air. God. Don doing a good job of keeping him in the corner. Up air. Don Don comboing him. What? Don just said, no. This set's not over oh yet. Oh my God. I might be at 100, but all I need is one It's hit. like a car full of kids on vacation. We are turning around. We are going straight back home. Yeah, well, I mean, that's what happens when you realize you left a pizza in the Exactly. Oven. And now for game three, where are we going to go? This is Chavo's counter pick. It's back to PS2 where he won a dominant game one. Because on Mario really benefits off those platforms in center, right? You take absolutely. those away, you take over Mario's advantage. Well, absolutely. And PS2 is still a good stage for Mario. Really, any stage of platforms that allows Mario to extend his up air spring is a really good combo. All right, it's my oh. time to leave Giant DJ Nuts. Well, we'll be back. I got another match. Well, as we start into game two, it's just me here, Ritual here on commentary. E e Chava and Don jumping into game three on PS2 real quick. Like up air, fair, 23. 62% on Don real quick here. Finds the revenge though. This is very close to even 68, just two hits. Chavo all the way back in it. I'm joined now on comms by Absolution Welcome. What is going on? Yeah, you just mentioned it there that honestly, Incineroar's biggest strength, even in what should be a bad matchup, uh, is that he can just rack up that damage real quick. And if you're like Chavo, skilled at playing into a variety of these characters, you know when to use And there Chavo. It is. For losing that first dock, however, that's the first time in both these games that Don has really managed to hold any real lead here. Let's see if he can maintain it. it he had that quick first dock game too, but Chavo clawed it all the way back and almost took that game, having a full stock lead himself at one point. However, Don doing a really good job. That game two, almost losing the set in 2 fashion in such an upset, definitely lit a fire under him. Fire already within Mario, but you know another one may be in the chair. As now 120% at Chavo, a full Absolutely. stock down. And there it is, another back air there. And we could be on pace for a three stock hit game three. This is a totally very, different Don than we've seen. Very close. Yeah, Don as a player is, is, I mean, Don is Light's training partner. Don has a lot of experience. Um, but one of the big things about Don is that he's a momentum-based player, right? Once Don gets going, then there is really no putting a stop to him. And if we're looking at this stage here, you can just see how these uh, these dual plats are helping Don get around a lot of Incineroar shenanigans, using them to just go over Incineroar so you can't get that Lariat. So you have to put uh, pressure However, on in other ways. Can he find his way out of the corner? No, well, he's up yep, throw, there it is. first stock. Uh, well past kill percent. All those taunts firing Chavo up, definitely taking a page out of Light's book there. Yeah, just a absolutely. Little bit. I mean, what we, we could see here, though, uh, given, again, Don's momentum, mm -hmm. is the Ooh, true taunt to get bodied. Off. There's the down tilt into the up air string. Oh. And oh, he missed the up Missed the up Chavo misses the command grab. And the big story of game three is games one and two, he had an absurd amount of yep. those. those. Like, a ridiculous amount. Like, his first stock game one, his first two stocks game game one were almost entirely a low limit. But now he's, and that's the game. Oh, but there's the fair. Wow. Like I said, all momentum. Look at those two. Some, uh, just a good, good pair of buddies. Known each other for a long time in here playing and having fun. And that's one of the other things there is that these players have been playing each other for a long time. They Absolutely. know how the other person wants to play the game, especially